Tonight, Murfreesboro police are looking for a group of men after more than two dozen shots were fired outside an apartment complex. And as Fox 17's Jennifer French shows us, neighbors say this is not the first time they've had to take cover. Jen? Scott, neighbors tell me they're scared, but not at all surprised. After so many shootings, they want better security. It just don't feel safe. Living here. It was like 20 gunshots. Is a gamble for some. A bullet. A bullet doesn't have a name on it. Kiara Fullalove has lived on the wrong side of town before. We came down here to better our life because we came from the south side of Chicago. Once Fullalove heard shots, she and her one-year-old daughter dropped to the floor. Her cousin LaJoy Adams was right there with them. We all just immediately got down on the floor, cut off all the lights, TVs. Police say several shots were fired late Thursday night. A witness told officers he saw four men running through the courtyard. Police found several shell casings and a moped with several bullet holes. But detectives were unable to find the moped's owner or gunman. I mean, it happens so frequently over here. Full of love and Adams say something needs to change. And then I think they need to do a better background check on people who they let in. The case haven't been up for a while. Fox 17 spoke to the leasing office. We were told the complex was just purchased by another company. The front gate will be fixed and the back gate will be closed. Background checks are required for all new leasing applicants. But here, there are some risks neighbors aren't willing to take. Because it's crazy, like I never want to come home at dark. Because they're not certain this won't happen again. Police had the moped that was shot, towed, and no word on any suspects. Well, our companies has just purchased the complex. In the studio, Jen French, Fox 17 News.